Edward Riley is a frustrated man after he was unable to pick up his three daughters born via a surrogate agency in Nairobi, Kenya. Speaking to the press from Ireland, the Irish National recounted the agony he went through, including a battering in Nairobi streets while trying to get his daughters to his mother country. According to the 33-year-old, the three were born prematurely on September 1st under a surrogacy program after paying an agreed fee of 5.9 million Kenyan shillings. The trouble, however, began after he arrived when the agency informed him that he needed to pay an additional 1.8 million Kenyan shillings. And I quote, instead of getting on the plane with the three babies, I'm coming back with three bad certificates. And I proceed, I've come back to an apartment full of baby stuff, coats, proms, and clothing. I've just been looking at it all the last few days. I can't explain the feeling. I'm devastated. Additionally, he was also presented with hospital bills that had been ballooned to 1.4 million Kenyan shillings as well as 1.3 million Kenyan shillings fee to the medics. He claimed that the Irish embassy did not offer any help and at some point while in Kenya, he was roughed up in the Kenyan streets and beaten up. And I quote, since I've come back home, I've been crying myself to sleep. I pleaded with the Irish government. I have a video on my phone in the embassy saying please give me help and there was nothing they could do obviously i can't blame the irish government for putting myself in this situation but they could have handled it a little better he decried according to the kenyan constitution surrogacy is not well governed a vital fertilization regulation allowing hetero Heterosexual couples to hire a surrogacy to carry a pregnancy is still pending. What is your opinion about this Irish national crying to the public saying that the government should help him access his three daughters born via surrogacy in Kenya? Feel free to leave your comment down below. Give the video a thumbs up. Hit the notification button. And thank you so very much for tuning in to Zafarani TV.